I'm Jack. And I'm Adam. And this is the Ares versus Athena video. We're going to compare a dual-sided Athena with a lat low row attachment to an Ares. We'll start with the plate loaded. So the most obvious comparison is going to be cost. A dual-sided plate-loaded Athena with a plate-loaded lat low row attachment is going to be significantly cheaper than an Ares. But remember, you need a lot of plates to be able to use it and somewhere to store them. But don't forget, you can use band pegs with the Athena, whereas you can't with the Ares. Let's talk max weight capacity. For the lat low row portion, a plate-loaded lat low row attachment has a max weight of 550 pounds. The Ares has a base stack of 260 and is upgradable to 310. You can use something like a gym pin to upgrade your stacks, but we'll talk about that in a later video. For the functional trainer aspect, the plate loaded Athena can be loaded to a max weight of 540 pounds, which will feel like 270 pounds in your hand. For the Ares, each stack will feel like 130 pounds for the base stack and then upgraded to 155. Now let's talk about the selectorized version of the setup. For the selectorized version of the lat low row functionality, the selectorized lat low row attachment starts at a base stack of 200 pounds and is upgradable to 300 pounds. And as a reminder, the Ares starts at 260 and is upgradable to 310. And don't forget, the selectorized lat low row attachment has the option to utilize band pegs. For the functional trainer aspect, the selectorized Athena starts with a base stack of 170 pounds upgradable to 220 pounds, which will feel like 85 pounds and 110 pounds respectively. As a reminder, the Ares feels like 130 pounds with the base stack and is upgradable to 155. Both can utilize gym pins to increase the max load of your stack, but the Athena can also use band pegs. Now that we've talked about max capacities, let's talk about the differences in footprint for each setup. For both of these, you're going to add 6 inches to the front of your rack in the trolley. Now we're looking at a 4000 right now, which has the handle in the back, but the 5000 will have the handle off to the side, which will add 5 inches. Now here's where things start to get a little different. The Athena adds 1.8 inches to the top of your rack, whereas the Ares adds 1.2. But also note, the lat low row attachment is going to add 3.3 inches to the top of your rack. So overall, when you're comparing the dual sided Athena with a lat low row attachment, it's going to add more height than an Ares. Now let's talk about the back of the rack. Both the Ares and the Athena on their own don't add any depth to the back of your rack. But if you're doing the dual sided Athena with a lat low row attachment, the lat low row attachment will add eight and a half inches to the back of your rack for a six post and 27 and a half inches for a four post. Now the band pegs that come with the Athena add 3.7 inches to the outside and the inside of your rack. If you have a 5,000 rack, this is still less than the added width that comes from the handle. But if you have a 4,000 rack, this is the amount that will be added to the width of your rack. So Jack just walked y'all through some of the main differences as far as pricing and footprint goes between an Ares and a dual-sided Athena with a lat pull-down and low row. But I want to talk about some of the main differences as far as functionality goes. The primary difference being on an Ares, you can do unilateral work on the lat pull-down and unilateral work on the low row. If you're looking for a never need to upgrade cable attachment for your power rack, the Ares is the way to go. Talking heavyweight stacks, lat pull down, low row, and a full functional trainer, all built into one. Let's talk about assembly times. The Ares takes about two to 10 hours to complete, depending on whether or not you're doing it by yourself, with a friend, if you're trying to put it together quickly, or if you're just taking your time. It's a pretty involved process because it's a pretty involved product. The Athena, however, was designed intentionally so that it was much easier put together. It takes about one person, one to two hours per side to put together. One of the greatest benefits of the Athena is its customizability. You can do dual plate loaded, you can do dual selectorized, you can do one of each, you can do a left or right, you can do with it lat low row or without. It's your rack, you do it your way. Hopefully this video answered your questions about the Ares versus Athena. If you have any further questions, please reach out to our Colorado-based customer service team. And as always, thanks for watching.